beauties welcome to my channel I'm Brene and this is bogus beauty and today I'm gonna be doing a swimsuit haul my first haul ever on swimsuits and I'm really excited I hope you guys are too so judging by my title you guys probably think I'm insane because who in their right mind spends over $200 on bathing suits A little backstory on why so much money was spent on bathing suits so I was supposed to go on two trips this year if you watch my previous videos I think I mentioned that and both trips got canceled so I got stuck with a lot of stuff besides just bathing suits like I got stuck with a lot of stuff and I have nowhere to go except next year Anyway, I'm talking too much and I know you guys are like, can we get on with it? So let's get on with the damn thing. Okay, so for starters, I got this swimsuit from Sheen Official and it comes with a choker. This is the full suit. It's a bandeau top. And it's a little like high waisted situation going on here. The bottom is a little cheeky, but I'm not going to show y'all that. So the next suit that I have for you guys, I actually purchased this one at Icon Boutique. This is when all their swimsuits were $16. I got it for the color because I think colors like this pop severely on deeper skin tones. I like that it's a little bit more modest, like this whole situation's out and it covers all of this, but it still kind of gives you a little bit of show, but not too much. It's also high waisted, which I love. So the next suit that I got, which is this one I love the Aztec print on it I always order a small just because I am a little smaller or on the smaller side but yeah this situation I don't know I don't really like two-piece bathing suits I don't like to show too much believe it or not I do love high-waisted I like things that kind of give the illusion that we're seeing skin but they really don't show skin so that's why I wear like a lot of high-waisted bathing suits but again I love this print I don't know I just would wear like a cover-up with this like a serious cover-up okay next up is this bad boy I am feeling this it's a little tight in this area but um I really like it I'm digging it it's a little cheeky in the back which I do not like but overall I love like the high waist on it um I like that it has this part open and not so much cleavage is out And as you guys know, purple is my favorite color, and I think this one really pops severely on my skin, like even more than the blue one did. So this one I love because I love a monokini. Like you guys, I live for a good monokini, and I like that the back is out a little bit in this one but not too much and I really like how this mesh kind of gives up like this illusion I really like it like I think it's flattering I would wear this like on vacation um somewhere tropic that's what this whole video is about giving you tropical feels and like just fun time at the beach and a lot of these bathing suits are really cheeky like I was not aware so I'm definitely gonna have to buy a few more cover-ups but I like this whole situation that we have going 
on. I like that it's black. I love that the mesh is even on the sleeves. I, I love it. Like mesh is really hot. So this bathing suit's a little bit more revealing to my liking, but it's still very cute. I definitely would wear this somewhere like not in VA. Um, probably to Miami or somewhere in Mexico out the country. It is super cheeky. Suns out, buns out cheeky. So I am not going to show you guys that part, but we can just kind of imagine how cheeky it really is. So this suit right here, when I first saw this online, I was like, oh my God. I love it, have to have it, so cute. It is not as cheeky as the others. Again, it's high-waisted, I love the high waist. I love this little situation where it laces up in the front. I think that's so cute. I actually used to have a pair of underwear like that when I was in like middle school. Why was I allowed to have those? I do not know, my mom probably didn't know. Actually, yeah, she did not know I had those. But yeah, so this bathing suit, I mainly got because I love the pattern on the bottoms and I love that whole lace-up situation and that they're high-waisted. I like off-the-shoulder stuff, so why not? Um, it's a little disproportionate because one of my boobs is bigger than the other. But hey, I like the bright orange on my chocolatey skin. And I wouldn't be wearing this here, but... I could see myself strutting this around Mexico or deep down in Miami. Okay, so this bathing suit is a little out of my comfort zone and I think I probably need a medium. I know this under boob thing is supposed to be happening, but I do not like it at all. This bathing suit is so cheeky that I am never gonna turn around. I'm definitely gonna have to buy, um, like cover-ups sorry about my little pudge but I like to drink and I think I like drinking more than I like having a nice toned flat tummy so for the time being this is what y'all got to work with all the bathing suits I just showed you guys if I didn't mention after the first one were from icon um, swim boutique or whatever they used to be called icon boutique I guess they're icon swim now so that's where I got all these bathing suits from I immediately was drawn to this because I like the stripes and I like the color contrast on it. I don't know. Maybe if I got a medium, but I'm not really digging how revealing it is. It's a little much. Okay, so as you guys know, I love a good one piece. Like, I like that the back is out. Show my tattoos off a little bit. And I really like, it's giving me like Baywatch vibes because it's kind of like up here, but not really. And I like this little zipper motion. Okay, so this has to be the most scandalous bathing suit I think I tried on yet. Um super cheeky but i am digging it like i love it it's very sexy to me but it's still covering up everything in front and i love the whole crisscross notion now i probably have to untie it a little bit because it is a little tight up here it's kind of suffocating and i probably could have got a medium because my boobs are really suppressed but i dig it and definitely would be wearing this like in Miami, for sure. Okay, beauty, so this one, funny story, did not realize that it's completely sheer on the top. So this was gonna be the bathing suit that I was wearing out today, but I have no idea how I'm supposed to wear that out with the top being absolutely completely see-through. The back is high and cheeky. And I'm like upset because this was the suit I was supposed to wear and I can't. I am completely bamboozled. Like I am, I don't even know what to do. And I'm supposed to be going 
like right now. I'm supposed to be leaving right now to go where I need to go. And oh, ah, it is cute, but like, sis, come on, like, whose idea was it for the top to be completely like sheer and nude? Like, no. It matches my nails perfectly though. And it's something about yellow on that brown skin. Yes. Ah. Okay, beauties. So, as you guys can see, there was a resolution for my huge problem. So, I just took this bathing suit top from last year and I just put it underneath, you know. Um, I'm gonna figure out what to do about this, you know, nipple situation soon. But, yeah, I promise you guys this is not the only head wrap I own. Clearly, I was gonna wear, like, one that had red in it. But it clashed too hard with this top, so had to improvise. I think I did a pretty good job. My earrings have red on them. That's cute, right? Anyway, I want to say thank you guys so much for watching this. And once again... You know, thank you guys so much for helping me reach a thousand subscribers. That giveaway is coming pretty soon. Probably my next video. I talk too damn much. But um, that video is coming and the giveaway is coming. So stay tuned for that. Thank you guys for watching this video. Be sure to comment below. Um, if you have any questions, I'm going to put like my height and my weight and like my size down below too in the description box but other than that I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you guys did enjoy even if you didn't be sure to like and subscribe and most importantly have a bogus day beauties <laughs>